Good afternoon. The first item of business today is time for reflection, and our time for reflection leader is the Reverend Maurice Callaghan, parish priest at St John the Baptist, Port Glasgow. Thank you. Years ago, I read a short story, and it was about a city called Omalas. And Omalas was one of these fabled places. It was beautiful, peaceful, prosperous, and all of its citizens were happy and fulfilled. Except in the basement beneath one of the public buildings in a cramped, filthy, windowless room, there was a small, stunted child that might have been 10 years old, but looked about six. And the child sat in its own dirt, and it's kept hungry, and it's always alone. No one ever speaks to this child. Sometimes people come in, and the child's kicked to its feet. The child, though, hasn't always been in this room, but although it cries and screams, it sometimes says, I will be good. But nobody replies to this, and the door is locked again. The people of Omalas all know the child's there. They know it has to be there. But a sort of contract exists for every child in that city between the ages of eight and 12 is taken into the room to see this child. And it's explained to all of them that everything good in the city, the happiness, the beauty, the prosperity, it all depends on that child been kept in this room in these conditions. The youngsters are, of course, very upset when they hear this, but the vast majority learn to live with it. Except that every so often, one of the youngsters does not go home. They leave the city and they don't go back. They walk away from Omelis. The contract of Omelus isn't just a fable, it's a reality of the world. Pictures show it better than words. A dead, drowned Syrian toddler in the arms of a Greek soldier. Because Europe's borders have become a deadly barrier. A burnt out tower block in a wealthy London borough. Because cost competes with safety in furbishing poor people's homes. Seas that are full of plastic, melting ice caps, starving polar bears and deadly droughts because we need our lifestyle. My good at the expense of others' misery. The contract of Omelus. Certainly Omelus is more of a mindset than a place. Good religion's always seen this. Good politics, good humanity. I've always seen this. It's all connected. The kingdom of God within me connects with the kingdom in you, the Buddha nature in you, the conscience in you. Everyone, everything, it all matters or it's all diminished. Discount one child. Discount a polar bear. And then we're back in Omelas. <laughs> 